We are in a climate and ecological emergency. Climate change is killing British wildlife. We need to hugely reduce our use of roads, cars and planes to protect nature and reduce emissions. To do this, we have to increase the capacity of our rail network. Domestic transport is the highest emitting sector in the UK and terrifyingly emissions aren't falling. For middle and long distances, electric rail is best. It has the lowest emissions, energy and resource use. Cars and roads take more land away from nature. The Eurostar trains on HS1 can carry more passengers than the M2, but take up a fraction of the space. We need more rail capacity. How does HS2 provide this? Currently in the UK, fast intercity trains in red and slower local trains and freight in blue are on the same tracks and getting in each other's way. HS2 means that the fast trains from three main lines, West Coast, Midlands and East Coast main lines, can be segregated onto their own tracks. We get three railways for the price of one and a half. The fast trains can bunch up and more services can be run, reducing domestic flights. This frees up bottlenecks and means that more local and slower services can be run on our existing rail network, serving local communities and getting lorries off the roads. If the HS2 Eastern leg from Birmingham to Leeds stays cancelled, HS2 would only free up capacity on one main line, the West Coast main line, instead of three. This is still useful, but it hugely reduces the benefits and only slightly reduces the costs. Any habitat loss is horrible, and like all net zero infrastructure, HS2 unfortunately comes with ecological costs. The HS2 tunnel is minimising ancient woodland loss in the Chilterns. Improving and widening existing railways, such as London to Aylesbury, would mean more disruption and more habitat loss, including ancient woodland. Let's focus campaigning on stopping road expansion nationwide. Let's hold HS2 Limited to account to minimise ecosystem damage, restore nature and share their data. Let's campaign for other railway lines to be built and reopened from East-West Rail to Northern Powerhouse Rail. Thank you for listening.